Hello, this is Dr. Haname Gorda, Consultant Orthopedic Surgeon, practicing at AHA OrthoCare Clinic in Nagarbavi, Bangalore. Compression of the nerves at the lumbosacral area can lead to a pain called sciatica, where the nerve called sciatic nerve gets compressed in the lumbosacral area, leading to a pain which goes all the way down to the leg. Sometimes it may stop at the thigh or it may go all the way down to the foot also. So this pain is called sciatica and this condition is called lumbosacral disc disorder with radiculopathy. And that is the scientific description for the whole thing. Now sometimes if you leave this particular compression for a long time without treatment or you don't seek treatment or it's not treated properly, the nerves that get compressed may get damaged permanently. So what happens when you get a permanent damage? There are two parts to it. There is a sensory part and a motor part. What is sensory? What is motor? Sensory is you feel something when you touch it or something falls on your foot, you feel it. You feel heat, you feel cold, you feel vibration, you feel deep touch. All these things are part of the sensory system. That is feeling of what is happening on the skin is called sensory system. What is the motor part? You move your joint, you need muscular strength for that. That muscular strength comes from the nerve endings which innervate the muscles. These nerves are connected to the brain through the spinal cord. So when there is a permanent damage, you got two parts as I said, sensory loss and a motor loss. The sensory loss cannot be compensated in any way. And sometimes if the area of sensory loss is very small, the surrounding nerve endings will grow into that area and you may get back sensation to an extent but not completely. But the motor loss can be compensated. So how do we compensate? Once we are sure that there is no improvement going to happen in any future, even after waiting for a certain amount of time, then we can use the muscles which are in excess in the surrounding area. What is this using the muscles from the surrounding area? When one area muscles gets weaker, the other area muscles get stronger. So the stronger muscles will can be rooted towards the weaker side to compensate for the loss. So this is the only treatment that is available. We call this as tendon transfer or muscle transfers. Other treat treatments include the damaged nerve can be repaired, which is very difficult when it happens very close to the spinal cord as in lumbosacral compressions. The one more treatment which has been tried recently is installation of stem cells into the area, very vague or maybe almost not there at all. As of now, it is still in an experimental stage. Maybe over next few years or decades, we may have a treatment for this also.